Well, actually, if you want to start, uh, you know, the AC comes in here, and we have a special filtering that we do on the AC. You can see that there's a little circuit board down here with uh, a capacitor on there. And then we use a special circuit breaker uh, instead of a fuse. Um, and that avoids a lot of, you know, how they make all the super fuses and stuff. Mm -hmm. and so we bypass that completely by using a, a special circuit breaker we found to be an excellent sounding circuit breaker. And then these are air conditioners that are absorb the RF that's on the power line and turns it into heat, dissipates it harmlessly, but it's completely non-magnetic, mm -hmm. unlike ferrites. And that, because ferrites can, they do some strange things. Mm -hmm. And then uh, this transformer is made for us by Mercury Magnetics, and this is supplies the uh, analog circuitry and the critical <laughs> clock circuitry and the timing circuitry. Mm -hmm. And then going on, we have more transformers. This is for the digital circuitry and then multiple windings. And so we can separate the power supplies for everything. And as you can see, you know, there's a section for all these different areas. One yeah. section for coming in over here is the uh, USB. Yep. And that's on its own board. So that's modular and upgradable should we ever come up with anything. And then here is the Ethernet module. And again, you can see there's actually two parts of that module. Mm -hmm. And so they're both upgradable. USB port for firmware upgrade. Mm -hmm. And so um, there's two sections of firmware. So one is you just plug in a thumb drive with a file on it, which you can download from the Internet and it upgrades all the firmware for the entire unit. Mm -hmm. Except the other part is there's separate firmware for the Ethernet module that gets upgraded right across the Ethernet input mm -hmm. automatically. And so we've made the whole firmware upgrade process really, really um, simplified, mm -hmm. you know? And so there's Again, two separate firmwares, but they're easily, mm. you know, done. So it's it's a, it's a stepping that whole game up to a new level. But so we have all these different power supply sections that feed all that stuff. Underneath here is all of the incoming digital circuitry for the uh, SP diff inputs. Yeah, and the uh, you know there's so many variations on that. And then uh, we've got the microprocessor under there and then an FPGA mm -hmm. that does all kinds of crazy stuff. <laughs> and the mercury transformer comes down here and it feeds, this is for the section that feeds the critical clock circuitry and this is the section that feeds the analog supplies. Mm -hmm. So what you can see up here, this is the analog board mm -hmm. And it's all completely discrete, uh, completely zero feedback, completely zero feedback regulators. Um, and then this side drives the line outs, and this side drives the headphone outputs. So. Oh, I see. You got a headphone output in front as well. Yeah. yeah. And you can't see underneath this board is the DAC chip itself. That's the new ESS 9038 Pro. And that's the that's brand that, new thing. That's a new one, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. yeah. And we've got a really close relationship with ESS, and so we were able to get the, um, the earliest uh, samples available and put this into this thing. And um, so that, you can't see it, but it's under there, and it's yeah. beautiful. And so that just is right underneath and it yeah. goes straight up to the audio circuitry. So everything is all laid out in a way where, you know, we keep all the transformers away from the critical circuitry. There's a logical circuit flow. We got modular things here, the front panel board with the display and the headphone jacks. And then uh, as little wire as possible. Uh, this is just well, I know we got digital signals for the display, yeah. and then the critical audio signals. We use, you know, high-quality wire here mm -hmm. 
to go up to the headphone jacks. So that's kind of the, the tour there of what, what's inside there. That's awesome. That's really good. Thank you.